Welcome back guys. Today we're going to look at some body armor. Now I'm not military and I'm not law enforcement and I know some people are going to freak out and say why would you need body armor? Well the short answer is you probably never will need it. But I'm going to try to explain to you real quick why the average person could benefit from having some body armor like this. If you're watching this video you're most likely into guns and shooting or preparedness. So first of all, if you do a lot of shooting, no matter what your skill level is, accidents do happen. So you can wear your body armor when you go out shooting just to have an extra layer of protection in case those accidents do happen. The next reason may be a little bit more controversial, but if you're like me, you like to be prepared for anything that might happen. And in the world we live in today, with active shooter situations and the increasing threat of terrorists, I'd like to know that if I felt like I needed it, I would have a way to protect myself or my family from those things. But let's go ahead and get into the body armor. Now there are many different types of body armor. Um, I'll let you do your own research and decide what you want or what you need. But the first kind is soft armor, which is what most police officers wear. Soft armor ranges from 2 to 3A, which is rated to stop pistol rounds. The other type is hard armor plates. And hard armor ranges from uh, level 3 to level 4, and that's rated to stop all pistol rounds and most rifle rounds. Uh, some hard plates are made of ceramic or other types of materials that are really light, uh, but they're also very expensive, and that's what most military uses. What we're talking about here is AR-500 steel plates. These are Spartan armor plates made by thetargetman.com and I'll put a link in the description below so you can find it. After doing a lot of research I decided that these are the best steel plates you can get. Now unlike some of the other guys on YouTube I'm not going to be shooting these plates because unlike them I can't afford to just go out and buy armor and then destroy it. But if anybody from Spartan Armor watches this video and wants to send me some to test, I'm definitely down to do that for you guys. I'll really show you guys how these things can stand up to some firepower. Now if you'll take a look on the back, you'll see that these plates are rated for level 3. And that means it's rated to stop all pistol rounds and up to 6 hits from high powered rifles like 7.62 or M80 rounds as well as 2.23, 5.56. 30 carbine, and 12 gauge slugs. Now nobody can guarantee that any plates are going to be 100% bulletproof, but these are proven to take multiple hits and keep on going. And that's one benefit of steel plates versus ceramic or something like that, because technically the steel plates can still be used after taking a shot, where ceramic is going to start breaking up into little pieces after it gets hit. If you've ever shot at steel targets, you know that when a round hits steel, it fragments and sends tiny pieces of the bullet flying in different directions. And Spartan Armors come up with what I think is probably the best coating on the market to solve that problem. Now this is a combination of a bed liner material and a special primer that only Spartan Armor uses. And it's designed to capture all of that fragmentation in between this coating and the steel plate inside and that will keep it from spalling out and hurting you. Now this coating is 3 8 of an inch thick and I'll roll in a picture of what the entry hole looks like to show you that when the bullet goes in uh, nothing comes back out of the coating. I will tell you that I've seen if these plates get hit with a bunch of rifle rounds in the same area that coating may start to fail but that's only after a lot of abuse. Now other companies claim to have a coating that's as good as this here, but from the research I've done, Spartan Armor seems to have the best coating. They do offer plates that have just a base coat, but that's only to protect from rust and corrosion. A base coat will not stop the spalling, so if you're buying these plates, make sure you read it well, and in the description it should say, that it is with proven frag protection. If it doesn't say that, then it's most likely the base coat. And while it is still going to be rated for the same calibers, it's not going to stop that uh, fragmentation from getting out of the coating. And as you can see, these are the curved plates. Now they do offer flat plates, 
and multi-curve plates but these curved ones they're just a little bit more comfortable when you're wearing them and they form to your body a little bit better these are the standard 10 by 12 plates they're about an inch thick and they weigh about eight pounds so they are pretty heavy compared to other stuff but these are the most affordable and they're going to last longer than any other type of armor that's pretty much all I have for y'all today. Maybe if I can get my hands on some more, I'll make another video shooting these things and testing them for you. But if y'all have any questions or comments, you can leave them in the comment section below. Please like, share, and subscribe, and I'll see y'all next time.